The FBI is taking the lead now, but it's really the IRS that you've been seeing going in and out this morning. Yeah, at this specific location here off Glenview Drive, that is who we've seen throughout the bulk of the morning, taking loads of those plastic bins full of papers and folders, as well as even uh, a number of the cabinets and file cabinets. You've seen them take out the drawers and then the whole things all together and putting it right in the truck behind me. Now, again, this all happened just before about 730 this morning is when we heard that release from the FBI saying that they were taking over this investigation and obviously had been for some time, but they have told us it's very simply that they are here just for a court approved activity. Uh, when we first got here, you could see even the front door looks like it had been busted in from their initial contact with the Hawks family. Tire tracks all over the front yard. Brooks, as you know, is the main suspect in Crystal Rogers disappearance, but has never been charged with the crime. And five years later, more than 150 state and federal law enforcement officers are now executing nine federal search warrants. As Kristen mentioned, they're conducting more than 50 interviews. They're telling us today throughout Bardstown. Kentucky State Police have also been been on scene here today, kind of watching over everything, saying that they in the past have followed up on hundreds of tips from the public and logged thousands of investigative hours in this case. Now, we mentioned Brooks Hauk. He is actually here. We were told that a number of family members, including Brooks, were taken from the home and detained for questioning. And we have seen him with our own eyes just behind me. He's up against a garage, kind of hidden from view at this point, surrounded by a number of federal agents as they continue to walk in and out of his house with more evidence that they will be filing away with the IRS here. And again, FBI conducting this. We are just in one of those locations here in Bardstown. Heather Fountain was here throughout the morning and was over at his brother Nick's house, uh, Nick Houck's house uh, with a grandmother this morning who were also taken away. We'll toss it to her for the very latest.